Hello guys, how's it going? Macman here, and today we are going to be taking a look at some of the new features in the new iPad. The new iPad was announced at Apple's press conference yesterday, so we're just going to be taking a dive into some of the major things that they talked about. So without further ado, let's head straight into the video. The first feature Apple announced was the new Retina display. This display features four times more the amount of pixels than the iPad 2, making it the best display on any mobile device. As we can see here, having the iPad 2 on the left hand side and the new iPad on the right hand side, we can really see how good the new display will be on the new iPad. The new iPad features a 2048 by 1536 resolution with 44% greater color saturation and an outstanding 3.1 million pixels. This is better than all HD TVs. The next feature Apple talked about was the new A5X chip, which is an upgrade from the previous A5 chip. This features quad-core graphics, and note that does not mean that this device has a quad-core processor. On top of this, we still have our 10 hours of battery life, which should last most of the day. Next up, Apple introduced the new rear-facing 5-megapixel iSight camera. This features the same advanced optics as on the iPhone 4S and lets you shoot gorgeous 1080p HD video and photos. Unfortunately, Apple still kept the VGA camera on the front of the device. Lastly, Apple introduced their ultra-fast 4G LTE. This is going to increase the speed of browsing the web and is a huge upgrade from the previous 3G. As far as pricing goes, we can find the 16GB at $499, the 32GB at $599, and the 64GB at $699. If you want your iPad to come with 4G LTE, you can find the 16GB at $629, the 32GB at $729, and the 64GB at $829. So guys, there you have it. Those are the major features Apple announced at the press conference. You can pre-order the iPad right now on Apple's website, or you can also wait till March 16th to buy it in stores. I personally pre-ordered the black 32GB Wi-Fi model yesterday, so be ready to see an unboxing and a first look on my second channel at the Pixel Tech. I hope you guys all enjoyed the video. If you did, please be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you all next time.